Hey everybody! I'm back with another unboxing, and today I'm unboxing the final BFF 2 pack from the Hair Dorable Hair Doodables uh, series. There are six dudes to collect in the series, there are 13 surprises inside. Um, each dude comes with an exclusive girl. This one is the one that comes with Willow. So you can see Willow here. We'll take a closer look at her after we figure out who's inside of our blind bag here. And here we've seen this before. This is the beach scene. One of my favorite ones. So that's pretty cool, I think. And let's just get right into it. Here is our clue number one. And it looks like our stands for this one are going to be a translucent, I don't, I, I think it's more of an orange. And here's Blaze coming to wreck the day. <laughs> this is a really small one. Here is our um, signature card for our girl, but we're going to hold off. Because I don't know, I don't, I want it to be a surprise who we got inside. So here's some sandals here, guys. So they're black, the black base with a little bit of red, I guess more of a pink, red pink. Probably could have used another coat of paint on the orangey red detail there, but that's okay. Let's go with our second clue. And here's going to be our second stand in here. Our signature our sheet of signature stickers. Get that to focus at some point. Okay, and it looks like we have okay, it's a little messed up here. It looks like we have a burger. Burger on a tray? Or a plate? There's a little place for them to hold it on there. And the burger is pretty nice. It's got the burger, got a good amount of cheese on it melted on there and some lettuce and our bun has some sesame seeds on it so pretty good pretty tasty burger let's see here we have three let's, where's our tear strip here okay there's just another sticker in here and get it to come out. So we got this sticker. We've had this one before. And then we got it looks like a milkshake of some sort. In a mason jar. <laughs> With it looks like maybe a chocolate milkshake. And then there's a red straw. And our fourth clue. Ooh, is that a cake? Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, what do we have here? So we have a hair clip of some sort. It looks like a cute little unicorn cupcake. No, a unicorn Pegasus cupcake. I don't know. It's pretty cute and animated here. It's got um, some metallic gold on its horn and it's Squinted eyes and mouth are also gold. And then you have um, yellow and a really, really light blue, like a pastel baby blue. And then we have pink for the cupcake base. And then the back is a, kind of a sparkly gold with a clasp. And then this can be held as well on the bottom. Looks like it's on a tray. This is a, I guess, a unicorn cake. We have some pearlescent flowering going on on the bottom. And then the cake itself is pink with a really light baby blue color dripping on the top. You can see the ears and then the horn. The horn is also done in that metallic gold, just like the clip. And then we have a dark blue base, or well, maybe a medium blue. Um, there is a little bit of paint flaw there, but that's okay because that makes it look like the cake is homemade. Because nobody's perfect, you get frosting somewhere, you know. So let's go ahead and see what we have in here. Let's see who our dude is. 
totally rad dude inside. Who could this be? It's going to be obvious to somebody because it's the only one we haven't opened on this channel yet, but I don't... I am not haven't been looking at the checklist. Okay. Whoa, whoa. All right. Stand by, guys. <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, just to let you know, our dude's okay. He just took a tumble. Uh, so this is... Oh, if I can get this to focus. Nickname, BBQ and Max. Hobby, we can BBQs. Claim to fame, Grillmaster. So he likes to cook awesome things. So we're going to get him uh, all dressed up and we will be right back to show you him. So here is BBQing Max um, out of the box and all done up to the way he's supposed to be. Um, we have his hair's got some a good amount of product in it to keep it parted and everything, but um, he's got dark brown and then maybe it li like red highlights on top of that. He has brown eyebrows. His eyes are looking um up into the left. And they're like a gray, light blue kind of eyes. Like, I want to say gray. Gray is the vibe I get. Um, he's holding his shake in one hand and his burger in the other. The burger was a little bit tough to get on there, but I did get it there. He, like the rest of them, has a shirt that's meant to look like he has two shirts on. So he's got a burger on his shirt there. With a yellow background and blue on the top and red on the bottom. It looks like he's wearing like this sleeveless vest. But overall it's just one piece of that goes to that shirt. Um I'll just kind of show you the back of it here. See where it velcros. And then his shorts are black. It looks like they have maybe some candy on them. So there's green green candies and then maybe a purple swirly candy. And then he's got his sandals on, and he's on his stand here. So he's pretty cool. I like his accessories a lot. So let's go ahead and look at Rain's bio here. Um, sorry, not Rain. Willow. Nickname is Willow Cakes. Motto is everything's better with sparkle. And then the BFF is Max, of course. So let's go ahead and get her out of the box, and I will be right back. Okay, so here is Willow Cakes, and um, she's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, she stays true to her character. I did get the, um, the clip up there on her hair, the bee, unicorn, whatever, cupcake clip up there. So I clipped that up there. Uh, her hair is really cute. So it parts to the side. The side has a little wisp that comes out. And it is tied with um, a string. And then on top of her hair, onto the side part, she's got a ponytail. that comes down and curls. Just ever so slightly. But it's very long. And then she has another braid over here that comes up. And I don't know if it comes into... Yeah, it does. It goes up and it goes into... Right here, the braid stops and it goes into the uh, ponytail. So she has a really pale pink hair with almost a white underneath. But the white's got just a slight tint of peach. So it's very soft and it's very pretty. Very long. Um, but we have the same problem that we've had with a few of the other girls. Look, you can see the hair plugs there. So, um, I'm gonna, <coughs> excuse me, I'm gonna go with the fact that it's just flat from the box, and, um, I don't know why they curled it like that. It looks pretty from the front curled like that, but since these don't have a, come with brushes, it's kind of, I'm gonna try and fluff it out and see what happens. Okay, fluffing it out did cover up those spots, but they're still there. Um... Her hair is not her hair is long, but it's not very full. 
so she runs a little short on that. It's not the case with all of them in this series, but mo a f majority of them, I'd say about at least half, um, have that issue. But anyhow, moving on, uh, she has a, a darker, like a, a nice tan complexion. Her eyes are looking up into the right. She does have a little tattoo of a cupcake. If you guys can see that, see if I can get that to focus. On her cheek there. On her right cheek. She has dark pink lips that are closed. And she also has the same matching eyeshadow. She has brown eyebrows. And just like the other outfits that we found in this series, they look to be like they're two pieces, but they're actually one. This one is supposed to be a dress, and it's really cute. It's like a, it's got like that sweatsuit type elastic on the bottom of it. So there's a couple of different uh, fabrics that are running in this one. Uh, and then she has a couple of gold stars that are on top of her pastel colored dress. Um, I don't, I actually think she's got a unicorn on there. If you look really, really, really close, I think there's squinting eyes and you can see like a peach mane and the two ears at the top. Yeah, I think it's supposed to be a unicorn face. And then there's like a rainbow type on her, like her jacket. That's not really her jacket. It's part of her dress, but it, it's supposed to be a jacket and they do a good job making it look like it's supposed to be another piece. I'd rather it have. I'd rather it be another piece, but um, that's besides the fact. <laughs> and uh, she has these cute shoes, really cute shoes. You can see they have wings on them. They're white, and then they have go a gold star in there. And then the part that goes over your toes here, it's it's a really pale pink. Another problem I have with this girl, and it's not a problem with the doll itself. <laughs> Her accessory, this really cool, cool unicorn cake, is awesome. They put the uh, part for the hand underneath the, uh, see that underneath there? Which actually might work out fine, but uh, the hands, the, the arm mold that they use for her are straight molds. It would have been better if they gave her more of a, uh, a bent hand so that we could put it up. Because right now, it took me a while to get it to push through, but I got her hand to hold it. She's holding it, but it doesn't look like it's very steady. I would have liked to be able to have it bend there so it looked like she was actually holding it. Uh, again, it's a nitpicky thing that has nothing to do with the doll. So. But uh, overall, this is a really cool set. Um, this is probably the set for the foodies. Because <laughs> we got a cake, we got a shake, we got a burger. So we're good. This is a, you know, It's a good lunch experience. And I think it's cute that their eyes are both looking towards each other, so that's really cute, too. I don't know, is that really, is that something that happens in all of them? No, it's, it's not. But, uh, yeah, so uh, my collection is complete, and I'm happy. And, uh, yeah, if you like this video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And, um, we will see you in our next one. Bye, guys.